Hi everybody, my name is Chris from Reading Town and thank you for joining us today for Kids Times. Now today we will talk about a very very important and famous and favorite food in Korea and it is kimchi, right? However, you have to be careful because there can be a bug in your kimchi. Now we are not talking about in the finished kimchi, right? In the mart. We are talking about the cabbage or the plant that the you know, bugs live in. So on the farms, not in the mart, right? They probably take out the bugs. So everyone or almost everyone loves kimchi, right? Koreans eat it every day. But the next time you eat your spicy cabbage, which is the plant, the cabbage plant, watch out. There might be a caterpillar roaming around. Roaming around means it is moving and walking and eating and just, you know, living life. It's called the cabbage butterfly because it spawns or it lays its eggs on cabbages. These eggs are shaped like corn. So the shaping is like a corn like this and measure one millimeter long so they're not very big they're very very small in about five days right a tiny larva hatches from the egg so from the egg from inside the egg what comes out a tiny larva and it starts moving around like this from the egg the egg is the beginning after eating its own shell to get nutrients the yellow larva turns into a green caterpillar. So after, this is the egg, and after the larva comes out, right, what does it eat? It eats the egg, right? It eats the shell or the outside egg to get nutrients, to get vitamins and to get food. So they eat their own egg, right? The same color as the cabbage, so the caterpillar and these plants are green, right? So we cannot see them. It's very, very hard to see because they're both green. Now it can hide, so it's very good at hiding from predators like you. So predators means uh, animals that want to eat the caterpillar. So maybe uh, some sort of a mouse or some sort of a bird. They want to find them, right? So you and I also are predators because we eat other animals. Okay, we have three review sentences here. A, a cabbage butterfly spawns or sort of lays its blank on cabbage leaves. So this butterfly is a mother butterfly and it is ready to make babies, right? And insects like this, they don't give live ba living babies sorry they give eggs so similar to chickens and fish bugs also have eggs right people like you and i and dogs and mammals we don't have eggs b to be stronger a larva eats its own shell to get blank so again, this is the egg, and after the larva is born, it comes out, it doesn't go find food. It comes back to the egg, and it eats the egg. Why? To get food, to get energy, and to get nutrients. Nutrients, we can say, is things we need to live. So we can think of it as vitamins, we could think of it as food, and water even. C. A green caterpillar can hide from its blank because of its color. So the green caterpillar, they want to hide because these animals want to eat them, right? So what do we call these animals that want to eat the other animals? We say a predator. So we can say lions are predators of zebras. Zebras are running and the lions try to eat them. So the lion is the predator, right? Okay, we have three review grammar questions here. A, everyone, blank, kimchi, and spam. So we want to say that everyone at any time, at anywhere, onjana, they, you know, like eating kimchi, right? 
However, everyone is talking about many, many people, right? But it is still one group. It is still one team. So this one team, we have to put the S. Again, uh, when we have one thing, we say one cat loves milk. One dog loves bones, right? And we use love when there's many. Cats love milk. Dogs love bones. However, in this case, everyone, it's many people, yes, but it's, we put it into one team. So we can even say the team, the team has many people inside the team, right? But that one team loves practice. Everyone loves kimchi, okay? B, right now, there might be a caterpillar blank about. So this keyword roam, it means to just walk around and travel around, right? So there's a hint here, it's saying right now, okay? So roamed, this past tense, this quago, is wrong because it's not right now. Roamed is talking about before, right? So right now, 현재, we will use roaming. Right now, I am standing, right? Right now, I am talking, right? So when we are talking about something that is happening right now, we have to put the ing, talking, walking, or standing. See, in about five days, a tiny larva hatches blank its egg. So, I know the, we see this word larva first, right? But however, we're talking about the egg. The beginning is the egg, and after is the larva, right? So we have to say that the larva comes from the egg. So when we say from the egg, we are saying that the egg was the starting point. It was the beginning, and we are going somewhere else, okay? So you come from your mother, right? And your mother comes from, who is this? Your grandmother, right? So from is saying what came before, okay? So again, next time when you go home or in school and you're eating your kimchi, you don't have to worry about the bugs. When they cook it, they find the bugs. We are talking about bugs in the farms where they're growing the cabbage vegetable, okay? So thank you for joining us today for Kids Times. My name's Chris from Reading Town. I'll see you next time.